special video with a short special request to a special someone and that special someone is Illuminaire and Luna Cultivation so let me give you guys <clears throat> a quick intro of who I am so my name is Santiago Baisan aka Freedom Gardens and I'm showing you that I'm fully legal fully compliant cultivate up to 99 plants <clears throat> and this is my official wreck with the golden seal it's official <clears throat> it's the most recent one and it's, it was mailed to me because they don't do on uh, walk-ins due to the pandemic or else yeah, I would have la had it laminated like they did when you in the previous years when you could do a walk-in <clears throat> so these are the ones from the past 2021, 2022 <clears throat> and this is my x-ray image one of them this is where I got damaged the main damage so it's neck, mid back, low back L5S1 this through my previous employer as an uh, apprentice and electrician. <clears throat> I apologize about that. So this is my little portfolio that I put together that goes with my girl to show that I'm fully compliant. If there's any authority or anyone wants to see my documentation, this is the copy. And I do apologize the poor lighting. And this is what this video is about. If anything happens with right. the law or anyone needs uh, to see that this is my medicine and it's strictly organic and it's specifically for my recovery for my healing for my spine spinal for my multiple lumbar spine work related injuries and this is more medical documents all right my lower back so this goes for my grow Oops, and so this is I'm um, reaching out to Luna Cultivation, Danielle R. Luna Fuller, the owner, and Illuminar Sean Brzez Zio. I hope I'm pronouncing this correctly. So I check out the website, obviously. I subscribe to the channels. I've been watching Eric doing all the unboxing, and I'm def definitely interested. So from the from all the products in your whole lineup, um, and let me clear something out. So I'm reaching out specifically to you guys, you know, from all the people that I met at the MJ BizCon. Because remember, that's where we met up at the MJ Biz. So from all these people. I'm specifically reaching out to you guys and this is uh, my request hopefully one of these eight options are suitable I have a special request okay. so number one is to sponsor my grow which is a five by five by six and a half AC infinity brand new grow tent <clears throat> number two any new upcoming products for testing and reviewing number three 
any items and products that have been returned due to defective, damage, faulty, and or needs repairs. Number four, any item products in clearance sale, 50, 60% off high D discounts. Number five, in the past, previous years, any inventory as far as items and products that have been discontinued. <clears throat> Number six, accepting any and all donations. Number seven, proudly <clears throat> Number seven, proudly supporting USA American made here local. And finally, number eight, accepting it as a giveaway prize opportunity. For example, like in other social media platforms, Instagram and Twitter. When you got to do repost, tag, and comment to enter a giveaway. So there you go. Sean Brissett from Illuminaire and Danielle R. Luna Fuller from Luna Cultivation. Um, see uh, which one will be suitable for my 5x5. Growing space, 25 square footage total from AC Infinity, Grow Tents, manufacturer. So see um, which ones um, you're willing to, you know, work out something. Reach out to me and let me know what you think and see if um, I could become part of the family. Okay, so I'm interested in the Logic 8. To be honest, that's my favorite number. But I was born in November 6th. <laughs> so it's between either the iLogic 6 or the iLogic 8. But either one. But whichever one is more soothing or it's best ideal for this 5x5. Okay. Alright, Illuminaire family and friends and potentially I could become part of the family and the grow team <clears throat> so let me tell you a little bit more about my grow and addressing my reach out so this is um, my main lighting source and this is the reason why I'm reaching out and I'm going to Go ahead and um, add a clip because if you were to take a measurement with your par meter, dead center on the light bulb, 12 inches, one foot away, ridiculous. Less than 500 umols per meter square per second. Alright, so this is a one foot marking, which is right there. And we're just going to protrude out slowly and level. We're going to bring it out. We're going to kind of centerize it to the light bulb. See the readings. Alright. Should be like around 450. Let me see if I'm right. Let me get it as close as possible. Bring it out. Don't lower it. Don't lower it. Bring it out. Bring it out. Yeah, so 450. 460. That's in 500 then. Just round it up. 470, 490. Yeah. So, oops, sorry, it doesn't go no more than 500 micro moles at one foot away. All right, yet again, look. Let's look at the intensity as far as micro moles at one foot away. We're gonna put it dead center to the light fixture, right at the bottom. Okay, yeah, 500. No more than 500. Okay, micro moles per meter square per second, and that's pretty bad. So yeah, let's rinse it up. Let's just try to keep it as. Okay, we're barely gonna be at the 1,000. 
Oh man, you have to be super close. Look, look how close I am from the light bulb to get to the 1000. Wow. This is bad. Yeah, I need an LED. Dude, I could feel the heat from this distance on my hand. Yeah, dude, this is bad. Alright, let's take the final reading together. Just to make sure. Alright, so that's one foot away from the light, right? Right here. How much are we gonna get? We're gonna put it right in the bottom of the light bulbs. Just right there. Not even 500. Add a foot away. No matter where. Well, yeah, there you go. But I'm no, I wasted. That's the thing. I'm, I move. I move up. Also, when you observe and you look at all the total ten um, height distance is being reduced by two feet. And I will add that clip of me showing you guys uh, taking that measurement. But yeah, so this is bulky. Takes up a lot of space. It's not seven feet, everyone. It's actually two feet because look, it's a broken tape measure. And as an electrician, one of the tips and tricks, you can use a broken tape measure as a fish tape yeah to get into certain tight confined really obstructed wall spaces man that you're uh, for whatever your fish regular tape, it gets binded it gets caught up and so something you gotta get clever so I learned this trick from one of my general foremen so that's why uh, Nick it's pretty much two feet that I'm losing of total height the approximate I know it's poor lighting I do apologize but look you can't crank it up that's as high as it goes and I'm losing all of this because of the way they designed this and they all this bulky light <laughs> yeah and this thing generates more heat than anything and like I said it's less than 500 micromoles dead center at one foot so away so I need this I've been holding on to it for too many years yeah I need an upgrade all right <clears throat> Hopefully all of this makes sense. But yeah, so I'm losing two feet. And and then also all the all the cons as far as the energy and not being efficient. I'm gonna bring that up as well. Yes. Those. I know. Old school. Hydro farm. Metal highlight. Rated at four hundred watts. Yes, your traditional old school technology. It's a heater. It just radiates and generates more heat than photonic energy, more lighting. And then finally, looking at my genetics, my seeds. Because I have all these genetics. It's all seed packages right here. About 13 of them from different breeders. I have everything that I need. I just need a good lighting source. Yeah, I'm still missing a couple of things, but definitely I do need a lighting source. But yeah, so I went to the MG BizCon and I met all these people, but I, I did my research and I'm reaching out to you guys. So I can start popping and growing my own medicine or my spine, my lumbar spine. Okay, so I can start growing my own natural organic medicine. Get um, hook up my girl. Pimp, pimp out my girl. There you go. Pimp my pimp. Instead of pimp my right, pimp my girl. Yes. Yeah, so there you go. Okay. Thank you for everything. Peace, love, and health. There you go. <laughs>